A school bus driver pulled over for road rage, and tonight her boss says there's a way to avoid these kinds of problems. Put cameras on the bus. News 13's Cole Miller is live off West Central with the story. Cole? Jessica, school districts across the country use them, but if you take a look inside of APS buses, you won't find those cameras. The owner here at Herrera School Buses says he'd like to see that change. Only kid just can't predict these things. She wasn't driving any kids home from school today. Instead, Linda Barreto faced a judge. She's been here for about eight years, never had really any kind of problem with her. Michael Herrera was Barreto's boss. He's one of the owners at Herrera's school buses. They contract with APS. The 51 year old was arrested yesterday after a road rage incident in the South Valley on one of Herrera's buses. Deputies say she also had powerful painkillers on her without a prescription. She also failed a field sobriety test. Linda was not a bad driver, okay? I don't know what made her snap. Herrera can't help but wonder, would putting cameras on buses curb these kinds of problems? And we had uh, video cameras on, the, on a couple of school buses. We were trying them out. That was back in the 90s. They didn't last very long. Herrera says parents were complaining. It was beneficial because the kids behaved on the bus because they knew they were being filmed. And even the driver, of course, they knew they were being filmed too, so it, it, it settled things down. Over in Rio Rancho, the district has put cameras in all of its buses, one in the front and one in the back. I hear from their safety people over there that uh, it helps, you know, with discipline on the bus and also takes care of the driver if he's not doing what he needs to be doing. Herrera says he can't foot the bill alone, and that's a big roadblock. When you have like 150, 175 buses, it'd be hard to put cameras in each bus. He'd like to see APS help out, but says the idea has taken a back seat. Not for years, no. Hasn't been no conversation started at all with this. Now these cameras aren't cheap. They can cost up to a thousand bucks per bus. We asked APS why it doesn't have those cameras on its buses. The district said they couldn't get back to us today saying they needed to dig into this a little more. Jessica, back to you. Okay, Cole asked for Linda Barreto as she's still behind bars tonight on drug charges and child abuse because there were kids on the bus when she had her road rage meltdown. Deputies are waiting on results from her blood test to see if she was drunk or high behind the wheel.